This is the criss-cross suture, which is very similar to the horizontal external mattress suture on the right side. First, you engage the buckle flap from medial to distal direction, which is the same procedure of the horizontal external mattress suture. But unlike the horizontal external mattress suture, you engage the lingual flap from medial to distal direction, not from distal to medial direction. So you repeat the medial distal directions and eventually you get the large cross mark created over the incision line. And you will notice the same downward inverting pressing vectors created by these two suture lines. The only difference is the pressure is more focused in the center of the X mark. This is the criss-cross suture.